Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to learn the three important terms that you should know. That is clubbing, cyanosis and koilonychia. These three important terms that you should know. Now let's see what are these terms. First is your clubbing. Okay. First is your clubbing. Now, what is the clubbing? Clubbing is nothing but it is the bulbous enlargement of the soft part of the terminal phalanges. Okay, there will be a bulbous enlargement. You just have to remember your nails, how it will be. Okay, normally your nail will be like this, something like this. Alright. The profile of the nail bed will be at 180 degree. And in case of clubbing, how it will be? Okay. It will be bent like this. That is, it will be more than 180 degree. The bulbous enlargement, that the profile of the nail bed will be more than 180 degree. That is the clubbing. That is, you have to write it as, what is that? It is the bulbous enlargement of the soft part of the terminal phalanges. Okay, soft part of the terminal phalanges with transverse and longitudinal. Okay, that is the transverse and longitudinal curving of the nails. Transverse and longitudinal curving of nails. Alright. The normal profile of the nail bed will be 180 degree. And in case of clubbing, you can see the angulation is like this. That is more than 180 degree. This bulbous enlargement and also there will be a bulbous enlargement here. Okay, this is one of the feature in the clubbing. And also there will be a bulbous enlargement of the terminal phalanges. Okay, it will be like this. Bulbous enlargement of the soft part of this terminal phalanges with transverse and longitudinal curving of the nails. Okay. First you have to mention that there will be a bulbous enlargement. Okay, it will be like bulbous. And there will be a curving of nails. These two points you have to remember. That's it about clubbing. Alright. And next is your next important term that we are going to see is cyanosis. Okay. Always students used to get confused with this clubbing cyanosis and koilonychia. That's why I'm here to explain you the difference between these three. Now, cyanosis, you don't have to get confused itself. From the name, it suggests, that is, cyan. It is derived from the Greek word, okay? That Greek word is the kyanos, kyanos. It means that cyan means blue color, okay? That cyan means blue color. Kyanos, that it means blue color. So what is the cyanosis? If you remember cyanosis as blue color, then that is the bluish discoloration of the skin. Okay, bluish discoloration of skin or mucous membrane. Bluish discoloration of the skin or mucous membrane. This will be your cyanosis. Okay, this because of what it is caused, maybe due to increased concentration of reduced hemoglobin. You have to mention this. Increased concentration of reduced hemoglobin. That is, it will be greater than 5 grams per dl. Alright. This you have to mention it. Now, from the term cyanosis, you can remember that it is a bluish discoloration. And it is because of what? Due to the increased concentration of reduced hemoglobin, that is greater than 5 grams per dl. Alright, 
This is very important. You have to mention. Now I hope you will be clear about clubbing and sinusis. Now let's move on to the third term. Now what is the third term? Third is your koilonychia. Okay now what is this koilonychia? Even this is the same. Okay. They have the coilos. That is coilos means Okay, coilos it means hollow and onyx. Okay, onyx. Coilos is hollow and onyx means nail. Okay. Now what is this coilonychia? This is the spoon shaped nails. Okay, you have to remember that is this coilonychia is the spoon shaped nails. You just have to think that the nails will be spoon shaped. Okay, how the spoon it will be like that. And so what is coilonychia? It is the reverse curvature. Okay, that is the reverse curvature in transverse. It is the reverse curvature in transverse and longitudinal. Okay, transverse and longitudinal axis giving the spoon shaped nails or a concave dorsal aspect of the nail okay concave dorsal aspect of the nail or the spoon shaped nails spoon shaped nails and it is usually most commonly seen in the thumb and the toe how it will be that is it is depressed in the center and raised at edges. This is the center. Okay, here it will be depressed. And here it is raised. Raised at the edges, right? How the spoon will be? Like this. And like this. Here it will be raised and here it will be depressed. Like a spoon. That is known as coilonychia. It is spoon shaped nails. You just have to remember this one. Alright. So these are the three important terms. First one is your clubbing and second one is your sinosis. Clubbing is the bulbous enlargement. Sinosis is the bluish discoloration. And what is third one? Third one is your coilonychia. It is the spoon shaped nails. That's it for today's video. If you like the video, hit the like button, share the video and please don't forget to subscribe the channel. If you have any queries, leave in the comment section below. Thank you for watching. Thank you.